Red Olympics 3. Two teams coming into this game from similar fortunes, Olympics winning against Liberty and Wafa winning against Chelsea in Brekum Olympics, showing great intent and purpose, but it was Wafa who asked first questions with this strike from Augustin Boachi going wide. Yeah. Uh, he had a lovely game today, Augustin Boachi. That, that, that strike there couldn't really keep it under control. Trouble the goalkeeper from there. And again, lovely skill to spin around Kasim Augustin again, straight to goalkeeper Kwaku. A lovely spin about him. Look at the way he got past Kasim, but the shot wasn't powerful enough to trouble the goalkeeper. Special movement, special delivery, Glasson Awaku putting Great Olympics ahead in this fantastic fashion. Yeah. The wall couldn't hold together. The effort broke through the wall. The goalkeeper couldn't seal his near side and the ball just crept in into the near side. Disappointed one for the goalkeeper there as well, but take nothing away from Awaku. He imagined it and he executed it. Olympics for a second goal is an own goal. Kunedu Ashikwe did all the run, trying to set up his brother and Kunedu in a bit to get the ball away. Kicks it into his own net and Olympics lead by 2 0 here in Sogako. Yeah, and taking another big step in this first Olympics. It's a big goal for them to take it to go to Awaku. They did see the quick run of Samuel Kwe. He did want to get his header and look at the spin on the header, trying to set up Watson. But the boy eventually came off. Good idea, he had a, who didn't really know too much about it. I feel sorry for him, but there you see, trying to clear the ball. But the first touch gets the ball off the turf and onto his knee and into the back of the net. The last place he would have loved the ball to go. And the first place Olympics would have loved the ball to go. And it's in the back of the net for their second. And what a result the Olympics are staring at. And again, it's another goal for Olympics totally against the run of play. Watch it. I say you see full. Sends a cross in and Wafa have put one back. This is brilliant. Some good play. Rehearsed from the training grounds. And not Estu Bontin. Has Wafa back in business. Yeah. It's Olympics 2 off for 1. It's a beautiful goal. And again, like I said, that is how you break the low block. They move the ball very well from one end to the other. And also, very good cut back across the face of goal there. And as Motu was arriving, the ball took a deflection of Kasim. Look at the ball for the switch from the other side to him. Lovely control with the chest to get past Saki. And a lovely cut back as well. Motu was the one who was arriving. Got a perfect touch onto it. Got a deflection in the side of the goalkeeper. And the game is very much back in the balance again. And Wafa continue now with search for the equalizer. He scored last weekend against two kick taken. Header down and that's the equalizer. Wafa have equalized. Justice Tosuche have drawn parity for the West Africa Football Academy. And we have a game on our hands here in Sogakope. Justice to Suche. The comeback is complete. Again, it's, it's, it's a very good ball into the far side. It's already the Yadam on the far side. Not set back into play. Olympics just can't deal with it. They just can't deal with it. I, I, didn't, I didn't mention earlier in the first one about the long balls into the far side. Nobody dealing with it. In this occasion, it's the same thing. Nobody deals with the head on the far side. Does well to knock it back across the face of goal. And it's a simple tap in here from there on in for Tosuche, who was in the right place at the right time to score what is the level at here. 2 2 from 2 goals down to 2 2. They did say they did something special. And they put Next stop for Great Olympics, they'll be up against Ibiana in Accra and Mudasiru onto the pass of Joshua Ru. Mudasiru and Great Olympics have taken a dramatic lead. Just a minute before the additional five minutes, Mudasiru has finally broken his goal scoring drought. Great Olympics. My, oh my, what a way to win this game if it ends this way. Oh, what a story here. What a story here we have in Sudakope. When you just thought these two teams were going to settle for the two-all draw, 
it would have seen who pops up with the winner, but it's poor goalkeeping. Question marks over the goalkeeping all over the place, and I say both should be doing better with that. You know, would have seen who did take the strike. He did gamble. He did take the effort. He did credit to him for taking the strike like he did. But you expect your goalkeeper, you are betting on your goalkeeper to make the catch. He fails to make the catch. The boys into the back of the net. An Olympics. They have stolen this. It's a steal. It's a big steal. And it's all three points. And it's a big man with his first goal of the season that perhaps gives them these magical points here from Sudago Bay. And the big man has every reason to celebrate the way he did. Yes. If you have not scored after much time. 22 and you score nobody takes anything from you but again here yeah. so what for they've been undone with some poor goalkeeping in recent times you remember how Sabi Akwa committed that howler on the stroke of full time in that defeat to Elmina Shaxin kept good Absolutely. and here are Sebon so virtually gifts in Olympics it's all maximum three points it's, it's, it's a night nice for for the coach's perspective and if you're if you are a player of Wafa you'll be disappointed for all the efforts he put through to be let down by that poor goalkeeping he must be very disappointed I say bone to back from recess Wafa kept believing but quick thinking from Awaku spotting the round of Ashikwe to try to set up Boateng and Kunedu unlucky to put the ball in the back of his net yeah quick thinking again from Awaku to spot the round of Ashikwe he's a willing runner lovely touch but the first one was good, it's an unfortunate touch by Kennedy. Brilliant play from Wachito. Ate Yusuf with lovely cutback. And Esubontin connects it, takes a deflection of Kasim and Wafa have one back and they can't believe him from here. Yeah, lovely switch from one end to the other. Lovely chest control as well from Ate Yusuf. And the cutback was spot on. Esubontin was arriving. But a bit of luck from that deflection from Kasim. Again, Augustine's cross. Headed down by Kunedu and Justice Tosuche heads it in. Yeah. And this moment, it was 2-2. With a lovely ball again into the far post. Nobody was marking on the far post. Kunedu with a lovely header back across the face of goal. And it was a simple tap in there from... But put himself in a very good position here. Goalkeeper out of... I mean, no man's land he got himself into. So, great Olympics. Defending well, ensuring... At least at this stage, they don't go down again. But just as when it was all heading towards a draw, the Wonder Club performed some wonders. Joshua Roo spotting the round of Mudasiru. Doesn't take time. He goes straight with a left foot and Osei Bonsu. What a blunder. Yeah, it's a blunder. It's not, it wasn't a particularly well struck effort, but Mudasiru wouldn't care. He didn't take the gamble and he didn't win the gamble as well but it's this man who is going to be blamed for at least two of the goals today you know it's with a serious first goal of the season just how we played him through and he made the run almost an awkward body shape that he had taken to take the strike he did take the strike he got a bit of power behind it but it was down the middle he was expecting the goalkeeper to catch it but the goalkeeper couldn't cut the big man's effort and it's his first goal of the season which has given them a massive massive three points and what a goal this would be in contest of the points that they are accumulating in this season for Olympics now taking them into 40 points and to the top of the summit incredible stuff five goal thriller ending in spectacular and dramatic fashion Mudasiru the hero from the bench handing great Olympics the maximum points that takes them to the apex of the league log here in Soga Kope. the Wonder Club have performed wonders here at the Wafa Park full time score Waffle for two, Great Olympics three. Wafa, you can always count on them with the possession. They got 61, six shots on goal, 10 corners, dominant side of course. They committed 13 fouls. No offsides. Six yellow cards for Olympics and one for Wafa. It's an exciting, thrilling, entertaining contest. A dramatic five goal thriller has come to an end here in Sogakope. It's bye for now from the Waffle Park. It's back again. I say this is our own. Let's cherish our own. It is, it is a shocking, shocking piece of goalkeeping here, but, but I see you wouldn't care. 
if you don't buy the ticket, you don't win the rifle. You don't win the rifle, and he didn't buy the ticket that he and he's won it. Difficult time, so Wafa goalkeepers. Now Olympics. Now they can go in for it. a fourth. Maxwell Abbey. He's not in a hurry to do anything special. But Samet, these are the guys who want to get things done faster. And there the whistle. Go. Is it the end of the game? Nope. Okay, yellow card for Maxwell Abbey. It's a shocking one because I thought there was advantage on for Wafa. Oh, yeah. There was a foul of the referee, perhaps should have allowed them to carry the ball forward then. It's in pure entertainment and this fan will be very disappointed in how Osei committed that error. Prospanate Ogun, after all he did to get this team back to level peg and those two substitutions taking off Lawrence Sejikum and Bassett and bringing on Kelvin Iadon Boache and then Agbevo seems to have changed the face of the game for Wafa only to be let down by that howler from goalkeeper Kudio Seibon too it's over five goal thriller in Sogakope and Glastina Wako led by example by opening the score with a sumptuous free kick they went up with a second after Kunedu's own goal but Wafa had other ideas came back strongly Esubonsin pulled one back and then Justice Totiche drew parity only for Sebonsu to make that mistake for Mudasiru to score his first goal of the Premier League season to hand Great Olympics maximum points here in Sogakope full time score one for two Olympics three Nija Shibote he's had a good game in that midfield picking up the man of the match had to come up against some experienced players in Akame Kuawaku and done so but he flourished in this afternoon's game and he's man of the match but that's not the deal the deal was about the three points and they lost it full time here in Sogakope one for two they came close with Isubonson coming nearer to Steven Kwaku here Ibrahim gifted possession to Ashikwe spotted his brother Abikwe's run but that was some interception from Atta Yusufu again he tried his luck went down in the box referee had no interest in a call first half ending with the great olympics the better side with a goal 